Hey, so, okay, so a couple things that's been happening in the past couple weeks as far as real estate. One is appraisal. We've uh, been, my team member has had an interesting situation where her listing came in under appraisal and she priced it out at what she thought was market. And, um, but that was able, thankfully, is able to work itself out. And um, she, my other, my team member also had a client, they put an offer on her property and it didn't appraise, it actually appraised significantly under what they were in contract on. Thankfully, there was an appraisal contingency to protect the buyer, but um, that was just unexpected to be that much under, under um, the offer price. Usually the appraisers tend to try to meet the offer price if it's within range, but in this case it didn't. So. Appraisal contingencies, keeping them or waiving them could be pretty tricky, just depending if you have enough uh, comparable sales to, to justify it. Um, the other thing is uh, another team member of mine put, um, and I put an offer in a property in Bernal Heights. It was listed in the mid eights, and um, we are in contract between 1 million to 1.1. We didn't think we were gonna get it. We thought it was gonna easily go to 1.25, 1.3 possibly but we got it at that price range and my, our client is super, super excited thinking that the client really, really got a good deal. So, um, and we were the best offer over 16 offers. So 16 offers and we decided just to give it our best shot, came in clean, no contingency. Sometimes you just have to do that. We felt like it was safe to do. Everything's running smooth. So I think that, um, that might be helpful for anybody that's on the market. Um, us agents are having to compete against other offers more now. We weren't having to do that the past couple months, but now it is. I've seen um, listings in November, December who uh, did not get any offers, get off the market or back on the market now and are getting offers and getting more activity than um, they did. And actually, people are jumping on these properties faster than they had. So it shows you that the buyer demand is is there people are out shopping people are out looking at properties so make your offers don't get intimidated in this case when with the offer that we got we, we didn't think that we were going to have a chance but we did i'm so thankful that we even tried um and my client our client really thinks that you know it was a really great deal so hopefully that's helpful but that's what we have right now uh wishing you a wonderful rest of your week and um, feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions